explain it, but strange things happen when I'm around. It doesn't bother me, not anymore. I'm used to the stairs, the whispers. But I wish I didn't have to hide who I am. I wish there was a place where I belong. What was that? Hello? No, oh, Gallopin Gorgons. What a small room. Who are you? Rubius Hagrid, at your service. Don't be nervous. I'm only here to deliver this. Ah, this is for you. Hello everyone and welcome back to the channel. Today's video is going to be a brand new game called Harry Potter Magic Awakened. It's a story mode game which also has multiplayer and it's a really cool game. Definitely a game for Potterheads if you are one. Today we are going to get ready for Hogwarts, get our owl wand and new robes and yeah, let's see how it goes. We are pleased to inform you that you have been accepted at Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry. Hogwarts School of Witchcraft and Wizardry? That's right. You're gonna study magic. The very next day we went to Diagon Alley to get what I needed for classes. We travelled all the way on Hogwarts flying motorbike. And the experience was mm. unforgettable. Looks like I drove a little too fast for you. Um, good. Let's have a look at your list. So as you can see, the visuals are very cool. I really like the style of art. And also, it's a very interactive game. It's more of an RPG than a multiplayer. So we have a story that we have to follow. So we are a student in Hogwarts who is just getting to the first year. So we select all our... Uh, Robes, wand and uh, owl. So that is why we are here in Dragon Alley. I also heard that we will be having a separate story for ourselves inside of Hogwarts in our first year. And we will be having a separate one for the second year and so on. So we have to write exams, we have to uh, play Quidditch and there is everything that you can necessarily have in the Harry Potter world. So first things first, we are going to go to Madame Malkin to get ourselves a new robe and to customize our appearance and as you can see here guys it says uh, witches and wizards cannot share a dormitory so please choose carefully the reason they have given this is because if you are going to play with your friends and if your friend is taking a female character and if you are taking a male character you will not be able to share a room so dormitory is like a clan okay so in typical uh, multiplayer games you have clans guilds right so like that we have dormitories here and just like in the story girls and boys don't share a room in Hogwarts so if you want to play with your friends and have a better multiplayer experience go for the same gender here for new robes dear oh, come don't be shy of a model Hogwarts student. Let's see what else is on your list, shall we? A wand, of course. Uh, you'll want Ollivander's for that, dear. His shop is very close. You'll see. Oh, there! robes have you then it's time to get you a wand this here is Ollivander's best ones money can buy go on your wands waiting ah 
Another young wizard. There is something familiar about you. Come, try out this one. Apparently not. Come, try out this wand. <laughs> oh my, curious, very curious. Okay, so this is the one that I got. It's uh, made of cypress wood and the core is dragon heart string and it's 13 3 by 4 inches long. So let me know if you guys got the same thing as well, if you did play, because I'm just curious to know. Oh, hello. Are you here for a wand too? Actually, I've already got one. It's just been acting a bit strange recently. Hmm, twelve and a half inches, cherry wood, and dragon heart string. A powerful combination in the right hand. That's what my Nana said. She taught me a few spells, but... I can't do them anymore. Could there be something wrong with my wand? Would you be so kind as to demonstrate, young miss? Okay, so this is how the game's uh, fighting system works. As you can see in the bottom, we have three, and then slowly the bar fills up, we have four. So that is like Elixir in Clash Royale. The more you have, the more cards you will be able to play. So we are going to fight these bunch of books. And we have this first uh, like inflating spell, I don't know the name of it exactly. So how you actually do is, you pull the card and then place it, like, like target it on the enemy. See I did it and uh, it's now inflated and it's like stunned for some time and it, uh, yeah it was stunned so we were able to deal damage. And now slowly our uh, like uh, MP fills up. And we have the other cards as well and like, like this you can get around the battlefield to move around and uh, okay since more books are coming now you can see an area damage spell uh, the incendio right incendio. yeah if I use it it just starts a flame right there and just burns everything down so that's like an area damage ability uh, like spell and the first one is like a stun so now I'm just going to do a combo stun them and then do the fire ability on them and yeah uh, so this is how the game works basically so even if you are dueling against another opponent this is how you will be playing they will be uh, spending cards from their side you will be using yours and uh, whoever wins well wins. done i haven't seen a young witch or wizard take to their wand that quickly since uh, since hmm. that was wonderful thanks i couldn't have done it without your help Hopefully, now I won't make a fool of myself when I get to Hogwarts. You're going to Hogwarts? Me too! I'm Ivy Warrington, by the way. Nice to meet you, Ivy. You too! I'll see you at school! See you there. Okay, so now we have got a new chest and this is where Thanks. we unlock cards from. The cards have different rarities, uh, so this is an epic card. 
it's called ventus and it's basically like a tornado it it stuns enemies and it also deals damage and uh, we have got another rare card okay this is the book that we were just fighting so you can just send it and uh, it attacks knocks back everyone in the range and then at the end it starts attacking okay so this is a rare one and this is a troop the other one is a spell and this is another spell uh, yeah just uh, like a lightning storm if you use it on an area it just randomly attacks targets on it for some time so this is how you unlock spells guys so there are uh, legendary ones and mythical ones so there are uh, two uh, higher rarities to epic ones <laughs> thought i'd get you a gift being as you're new to magic an owl is mighty useful y you do like owls don't you of course you do Come on then, let's find you a good one. Hello there! You must be the student Hagrid mentioned. Oh yes, he's quite fond of you. <laughs> I couldn't decide on an owl, so he left it up to you to choose. Go on then, have a look for yourself. <laughs> Hi there, friend. Want to come with me? <laughs> Got everything you need? You must be excited to go to Hogwarts. Don't worry, you'll get there soon enough. Since it's your first time in Diagon Alley, you can walk around a bit more if you like. Okay, so that's basically the game, guys. Uh, it's very fun and uh, like very immersive. Uh, so we can just walk around like it's an RPG. It is an RPG, but also there is uh, multiplayer options. You can share dormitories with your friends, design characters. And you'll also Hello. be joining houses Are as you going well, to like Gryffindor, Slytherin, yes, Hufflepuff and Ravenclaw, right? You'll also you be sorted into houses. It's and here I'm just talking Daniel to random people to Page. see what they have to say. It's mind, like this guy is like kind of busy, so an introvert who sorry. doesn't like Good luck finding social interactions. See you at school. Okay. Sure. And yeah, Bye. so let me know what you guys think. Uh, like if you download the game, let me know what wand you got, like uh, the core and the length of it because I just want to know if it's random or not and yeah so we have a huge story ahead of us uh, this video I'm going to end here I'll not be going to Hogwarts in this one let me know if you guys want to see part hey, 2 and in part 2 we'll go My to Hogwarts Robin. and uh, we'll meet you, start Robin. the story there so do you like Quidditch or do you love it I don't really know much about Quidditch what are you a muggle oh oh sorry you aren't really a muggle are you Sorry, was it wrong to ask that? Huh, Merlin's beard, I'm terrible at introductions. Got everything you need? You must be excited to go to Hogwarts since it's your first time in Diagon Alley. Before I knew it, it was time to go to school. Okay, so in the next episode, we'll meet all these people. They are just giving us introductions of them. And yeah, so stay tuned guys and let me know in the comments what you think about this game. And thank you so much for watching guys. I'll see you guys in the next video.